Good afternoon to one and all. This is Malyadri from Government Politic, Nellur, lecturer in Civil Engineering. Today, I would like to discuss about tachometry surveying. It is a branch of surveying in which horizontal and vertical distances are measured in instrumental observations along with an instrument tachometer. In this survey, chaining operation is completely eliminated and also used in the survey very difficult situations like uh, direct uh, leveling and chaining operations not possible conditions. The instruments used in tachometry is tachometer, leveling staff, stadia rod, ranging rods and plumb hub. First one tachometer. Tachometer is a transit theodolite with providing analytical lens and diaphragm. Leveling staff. Leveling staff is used for ordinary leveling operations with a short distance with a least count 5 mm and uh, 4 meters long. Next stadia rod. Stadia rod is used for greater distance with least count 1 mm and used for 4 meters length. Next principle of tachometry. The main principle of tachometry is the property of isosceles triangles. Next one, method of tachometry. There are two methods. One, stadia tachometry, tangential tachometry. First, stadia tachometry. In this method, the tachometer fitted with two stadia heights, one upper, another lower. The difference between upper and lower stadia hair readings is known as a staff intercept. While taking readings, the upper and lower stadia hair readings are noted and recorded. The stadia hair method is used for inclined sites also. Then the stadia tachometry divided into two methods. First one fixed hair method, next mobile hair method. First fixed air method, it is a common type of method in which the stadia hairs are kept constant at fixed intervals and the staff intercept varies along with the distance from instrument station. Next mobile hair method, in this method the stadia hairs are adjustable by using micrometer fitted with diaphragm and the staff intercept on leveling staff is fixed by using two targets. Then go for tangential method. Tangential it is a in this method the horizontal and vertical distance are measured by using vertical angle for two veins. But it is not preferred in this method because in this method there are two vertical angles are required for calculation of distance. But stadia method, one vertical angle is sufficient. The uh, tachometry, they have two constants, one additive constant, other one multiplying constant. While providing analytical lens in tachometer, the additive constant is zero and multiplying constant 100. Analytical lens. Analytical lens is a concave lens fixed to the diaphragm between object and eyepiece. While providing analytical lens, the additive constant should be eliminated. The main advantage of analytical lens is to simplify the distance equation in tachometry. Thank you to one and all.